I mean, I think the ceiling is high for everybody on the team. Yeah. I think we're all learning this system. We're all learning these coaches, and I think we've all gotten a, a better sense of our place in the defense and a better sense of how the coach is going to use us. And I think that, you know, our potential is going to get reached. At, its, at his best, what is Danny Fennell, the, the kind of player, the, the skill set he has? At my best, I'm a hard-working blue-collar guy like the, like the identity of our defense. You know, I, I may not be the biggest, strongest, most talented guy, but I mean, I'm going to give my all. And I mean, if that's not good enough, then that's just how it shook out. I'm going to try harder next time. But at the end of the day, I'm just a guy who's going to leave it all out there. What's the next step, not only for you, but for this defense as a whole, coming off a, a year where you guys struggled a little bit and battled those injuries? The next step is just looking at ourselves in the mirror and being real. You know, that's something that we've always talked about. We we know what we have to do. We have to come together. We got to stay healthy. We got to be disciplined. We know that and we've been known that, but we just have to actually apply it. And with the experience we've gained and with the just the overall depth that we have all around the defensive roster, I think that's going to help us take the next step. Where do you see your role kind of fitting into this? Are you working more as Buck Sam or? Where do you kind of see yourself fitting in? We're early in the process. Right. We're early in it. So, I mean, the depth chart that they show us, it's they, they tell us this is a rough draft. Everything yeah, on this is likely to change. Way. So, I mean, they tell me to be ready for everything, and that's what I am. I know Sam. I know Buck. I know N. So, whatever they want me to do, wherever they need me, I'll be there. Any, have you worked closely with Jamar Brown this offseason a little bit, or is he kind of focused on See, he, I mean, the thing is, he's playing Sam also, but we have it set up. I am coached by Coach Hutzler at times, right. but most of the time I'm handled by Mike P. Okay. And Brown, he's with Coach Hutzler. Right. So we, we've kind of stayed apart, I but I've seen, yeah, I've seen his work, though. He, yeah, he's looking good. What about Hot Rod, Rodriguez Fit? <laughs> no, yeah, Hot Rod, man. Yeah, he, um, man, we've been working all summer, man. Hot Rod came in, you know, his eyes are just lit up by it all, and I love it. His spirit, you know, is something that it's good for the team, you know, and we've been working. He's been <laughs> asking questions about his get off and different things, you know, yeah, it's what been does he fun. Compared to, is a guy that you've played with, watched? Who does Hot Rod compare to? If I had to compare Hot Rod right now, I have a guy I played high school football with. His name was Muhammad Barry. Um, he plays for Nebraska right now. Okay. They're so similar. They act alike. Really? And it's just, it's funny. They play kind of similar. Muhammad's a little older, so I mean, he's he's more developed. Well, he's way older, but he's more okay. developed right now. But I can see it. I can see it in tools, Hot Rod. Tools, yeah, like, he's, yeah, he's a good guy. Obviously, the video came out with the football team. You work a lot with the Darlin Moore School. Just take me through some of the stuff that you've been doing there and kind of how does that impact your future plans once football's over? Um, I just I got my undergrad last December, a management science degree, and I'm trying to get my master's right now in international business. And I'm just applying everything that I can in there. You know, I mean, the management science, that's just a good trade, I feel, a good skill to have. And the international business, it's, it's recognized nationally. So, you know, I just... I'm just trying to get all I can get right. out of out of this whole opportunity, you know, and it's just they work with you. Yeah. They really work with you to make it happen. I know a, a few guys are venturing over to the business school and I hope it works for them too. Any com any traits to shared between the football program and the business program? Any who? Traits, comparisons you can draw. Skills, results, results, results cutthroat, you know, yeah. business is so much like football, football is a business. So I mean, in the business school, they, you know, the, <laughs> you know, the the international business, they get a lot of attention because they're number one in the nation. You know, results really drive both these environments.